Hello, Joe here from Infinity of Tacoma. I'm here to tell you about this 2015 Infinity Q50 hybrid that we have for sale. Uh, really cool version of the Q50. Unfortunately, 2018 was the last model year of the hybrid. Um, so if you really wanted a uh, Q50 hybrid, this particular example is a great one to consider. Unfortunately, they didn't really sell that great on the new side of the market, but in the pre-owned market, they actually sell really well. So um, I'm also the used car manager here. So whenever I see a Q50 available for sale off lease, I always jump at the opportunity of getting one because um, we do really well. This only has 28,098 miles at the time of making this video. Local uh, one owner clean Carfax vehicle recently acquired off lease. We do have a complimentary Carfax report. Beautiful color combination in uh, Venetian Ruby on um, black leather. You have a drive mode selector to tailor the transmission shift points, throttle sensitivity, uh, traction stability, stability control setting for different types of driving situations. Uh, power and heated front seats. Also has a heated steering wheel. You can see it has a dual display system. The top screen is for navigation, for the rear parking camera. The bottom screen is a tablet-like interface for vehicle settings and apps. This one has a great sounding Bose audio system. Beautiful aluminum trim throughout. Power adjustable steering wheel that tilts and telescopes. Moonroof. Automatic dimming mirror with universal garage door opener. The hybrid system used in the Q50 is a very well proven uh, hybrid system. It first uh, was used in the 2011 M35H, so it's not a new system at all by 2015. It's a very well proven system. Uh, it was kind of ahead of its time when they developed it because uh, Infinity used lithium ion batteries uh, for their hybrid system, which is a little bit more, a um, little bit more space saving than the alternative uh, battery technology that they had earlier in the years when they were uh, hybrids were first starting to become popular. The nice thing about the lithium ion battery pack, it doesn't take as much space. A lot of times when you see uh, hybrid sedans, uh, the trunk space is limited uh, due to those large battery packs, but you don't lose quite as much space in the Q50 due to the smaller lithium ion battery pack, but still very powerful. Um, you can travel up to a, about a mile just under electric power alone and up to speeds of 60 miles an hour. Uh, that electric motor makes about 60 horsepower, and then you have a 300 horsepower uh, gasoline uh, engine, so you have a combined output of 360 horsepower. Very quick, in fact, the Q50 hybrid was the fastest version of the Q50 that you could get back in 215. Until they came out with a Red Sport 400 making 400 horsepower, uh, the Q50 hybrid was one of the most powerful and quickest uh, Q50 versions that you could get. Um, fantastic 3.5 liter V6 at the use of the hybrid. The VQ35 engine is still using a lot of Infiniti and Nissan products. A very well proven engine, very reliable. Um, look at this beautiful color combination. Uh, Venetian Ruby is just a stunning color. Uh, this one also has intelligent all-wheel drive, so it's great in the wet, slippery weather we have in the Pacific Northwest. And that all-wheel drive system will greatly improve your wet weather traction. Uh, just because it's a uh, high performance hybrid doesn't mean it's not fuel efficient. You're going to get right around 30 miles per gallon in the city and on the highway. But uh, the whole idea about the Q50 hybrid is supposed to give you V8 levels of performance of V6 slash four cylinder type fuel economy. Come and take it for a spin. I think you'll be very impressed. And um, please contact us if any questions. Thanks for taking the time today to watch this video.